Hello everyone, what's up? Jay Wisp here and welcome to episode 12 of the Minecraft 1.15 Survival Let's Play. Today is a very special episode, an episode I'm super excited for because today we will be fighting the Ender Dragon. So in the last episode, we worked on making a little enchanting hut and I also showed you guys my method for getting lots of XP quickly and of course it's got to rain on us here. <laughs> but let me show you what we did over here. We created a little enchanting hut and we enchanted a lot of items and I actually got some really good items. But here's the hut and since the last episode, I've actually done a lot of enchanting. I ended up enchanting a full set of diamond armor, which is pretty good. It's not the best armor, but it's fairly decent. Uh, oh my gosh! <gasps> The bridge and the iron column. I heard the lightning and I looked over and saw the fire. Oh my gosh. No, 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 no. Okay. Oh, this is not good. We need to sleep. Hold up. I don't know what's It always... Ah. All right, hold up. Let's sleep really fast. We got to set our respawn point. This is like the first time I've ever had a thunderstorm in this world. Okay. Are we good now? Are we good? All right. I think we're... I think we're okay. All right. Uh, so I gotta heal my iron golem. But anyways, we did some enchanting. I got some really good armor, weapons, and tools. All that good stuff. Um, everything's A-OK. -okay. I did a lot of enchanting, though. I had to do a lot of quartz mining to get this much XP. But we have some good armor and weapons, and so that's why I want to fight the ender dragon now. I also have defeated a lot of endermen to get the ender pearls. I think I have, like, 20-something ender pearls, which might not be enough, but I think it'll be okay. Uh, yeah, here it is. And then I also need to get blaze rods. And then somewhere else in these chests, not this bow, but I made a bow that I wanted to enchant just on camera for you guys. Oh, there it is. Uh, to show you guys me enchanting something. <laughs> but let's go make the Eye of Enders really fast, and then we can enchant the bow. Hopefully we get something good. As long as I get some sort of like power enchantment or something like that, I'll be okay, uh, and I'll be satisfied. I also have no idea where this stronghold is, so I'm hoping it's relatively close. Uh, but, oh shoot, I forgot to get iron to heal him. Well, it's okay. I think he'll survive. Let's go enchant this bow really fast. Hopefully we get some good stuff. I have a few arrows in case we don't get an infinity or anything like that. But, alright, let's do this. Put the lapis in. And, oh, I don't... I'm so dumb. <laughs> I wasn't even paying attention. I don't even have 30 levels of XP. I don't know what I was doing. All right. <laughs> Let's head up into the nether portal. Let's collect some quartz and get some XP. Ugh, I've just been getting ahead of myself. I didn't even notice I didn't have XP. I've, I've honestly, I've just been a little off. It's, you know... I'm in high school, I'm a senior in high school, and I explained this in the last video, but you know, it's the classic week before Christmas break, I have tons of finals, tons of tests, well not finals, but midterms, and I, <laughs> I'm honestly just done for, I've been sleeping like 5 hours a night, I'm exhausted, thankfully though, I'm recording this on a Thursday, so then tomorrow at school on a Friday, I don't really have to do much school. Um, my school district does this thing where we go caroling at younger schools like a few select musicians get to go So like me and a few other brass players um, <laughs> We're in a group and so finally after tomorrow I just get to relax and sleep and <laughs> get back to normal video recording and streaming schedules But I don't know the last few days. I've really just been worn down. I at least you know I normally handle stress well it's not actually affecting me that much. It's just by the time I get home and I'm done from school, I'm just done. I'm exhausted. I've had so much caffeine pumping through my veins the last few weeks. I'm probably going to have a heart attack. But regardless, that doesn't matter. What matters right now is that I get a good enchantment on this bow and we defeat the Ender Dragon. Uh, so let's head back to the portal here. And then... So regardless of what we get on the bow, I also, I'm trying to think what I need to bring with me. I should probably bring a water bucket in case the ender dragon knocks me down. Uh, I need to get to the other side here. I should also probably bring some blocks to build up. Uh, what else would be useful to bring to the fight? Maybe a few golden apples to be safe. And then, yeah. And then I think probably in the next episode or in the next few episodes, I'll do an episode dedicated to trying to search for end cities and hopefully we can find an elytra or two find some good items in the chest uh and there is a chance that the items you find in the chests could have mending so if we could get mending on some of our items that'd be really cool but let's enchant this bow hopefully we get something good i'm hoping for it place down the lapis boom i didn't look what is it 
Power 3 on breaking 3. All right. I mean, hey, that's decent. I'll take it. <laughs> I'll accept it. But let's head now. I'm going to gather everything I need, and then we can start finding our way to the stronghold. All right. So here I've gathered all the supplies I think I'll need. So let's take our Eyes of Ender. And hopefully... Oh, okay. Got to go this way. Please don't fall in the ravine. Okay, we got it. So let's head in that direction. Um... Normally, I would bring more Eyes of Ender, but, you know, I think I'll be okay because when you throw it into the air, there's a chance that it will fall back down to the earth instead of, you know, totally getting destroyed. But the chance of it falling down is actually pretty high, and I found that on my trip to the average stronghold, I usually only lose maybe like three or four Eyes of Ender, depending on, obviously how far the stronghold is but ever since the village and pillage update where villages spawn a lot more frequently i also feel like and this could be wrong but in my opinion it seems like strongholds also spawn more frequently which means you're usually closer to a stronghold than you think no more than a thousand blocks or two so let's check out another eye of ender okay keep going in this direction there it is so i'm gonna walk in this direction a little bit and hopefully we can stumble upon a stronghold pretty soon here. All right, so I've had the eyes lead me here about a thousand or so blocks away from my base. So let's head down. Seems to be probably right under us because at this point is when I shoot the eyes of Ender and they just go straight down. So I'm going to dig straight down. I know some people warn against that. I think I'll be fine. I'm some of that always dig straight down and I don't usually die. It's pretty rare if I die. Um, so what I'm going to do is go down like halfway and then build a little box and see if I need to go up or down. So let's do that here. This is just the method I use. I always dig to about Y30 and then I shoot another Eye of Ender in this little boxed room so I can see if I need to continue going down. Oh, well, I guess I don't need to shoot one because <laughs> it looks like we found the stronghold. I spy. There we go. There's the achievement. And oh, okay. Pretty different stronghold interesting though it looks cool i like this let's look around here though see if we can find the room see if also we can snatch a few chests actually i don't really need that iron sword that's not anything too good and there's the chest room that was pretty easy <laughs> so let's break down the spawner really fast don't need that place down some eyes i didn't lose too many on my way here so there we go all right let me make sure I have everything I need. I don't need the eyes. Let's put our golden apples in. And let's head down. <laughs> here we go. To the end. Okay, let's do this. Ender Dragon, here I come. Hopefully this fight will be pretty easy. Sometimes I have a hard time with the Ender Dragon fight. Sometimes it's pretty easy. The only time it's ever really hard for me is when the ender dragon does her move where she like shoots you into the sky and you go like 200 blocks and then you fall back down and you always end up dying to fall damage so let's see all right it doesn't look like there's too many of these towers so this should be a relatively easy what i'm gonna do to make my way up these towers is i'm not gonna worry about building i think what i'm gonna do is just my normal method of placing water buckets and then just kind of swimming up because when you're placing blocks it's kind of annoying because the inner dragon will sometimes shoot you up like i was talking about and when that happens you know you're just stuck at the bottom of what you built again so you have to build your way back up plus with the water um am i lagging what the heck why is the water just sitting there hello water <laughs> um but plus with the water you know if you fall you can just land in the water and you'll be safe Okay, I don't know what the water was doing there. It was acting kind of weird. I, <laughs> I think there's still a few bugs with 1.15. I'm encountering a few things here and there that um, aren't the best. All right, there we go. We got that one. Let's. Oh, he's actually trying to get us. Oh, wait, while we're up here, we should actually... Let's try to shoot down some of these other... Oh, I can't get it. Actually, you know, let's go to the top of this tower really fast. Try to shoot down some of these other crystals. Now that we have a good vantage point. Okay, there's that one. Can we reach that one? Okay, got that one. <laughs> Watch us get all of them, okay? We got that one. Oh, those two are caged off. Okay, can we get you? Okay, we got that one. <laughs> Pro sniper skills right there. I, we got that one. Um, I swear I don't have aimbot. What the heck? My Okay, we got that one too. Now we just have those. <laughs> I don't know why this is so easy for me. I feel like I'm almost cheating. Okay, well, not anymore. I <laughs> just got shot. 
All right, we're gonna have to go down below this water. Oh, we actually didn't get hurt. Okay, so we just have to get those two. Oh, okay. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> I didn't mean to take all that fall damage. Let's sit here. Let's regenerate really fast. <clears throat> I don't want to waste a golden apple if I don't have to. <clears throat> Alright. So with these towers, I think I should just be able to build my way up and we'll be okay. I'm not too concerned with the fall damage since we're really not that far off the ground. Alright, so you are done for. And then we have this one more. Do you have... Oh, okay. I almost just jumped down. This one does also have iron bars on top, so it looks like we're gonna have to build our way up. Oh! Okay, we have some angry endermen. Here, they won't attack us with that. <laughs> that protects us. Come on! Come on, endermen. What you trying to do? You wanna fight me? I have sharpness four and sweeping edge. You can't do anything to me. Okay, let's take you out. And take you out as well. Oh my god! Whoa! Oh, that was the dragon! I was like, what's hurting me so much? All right, <laughs> let's take out this final crystal and then we can go working on the actual dragon here. Oh, it actually let me shoot through that little hole. I didn't think it would. All right, so I think, I'm pretty sure we got all of these. It looks like we got all of them. I don't know if we actually got all of them, but it doesn't seem like the ender dragon is regenerating at all. So time to shoot him. Oh, we got the take aim achievement. Unfortunately, though, we only have 16 more arrows, so I'm going to have to do most of the damage on the Ender Dragon with my sword. Just kind of wait for him, or I should should, should say her, uh, since she lays eggs, to fall down, and then we'll have to attack her. I don't have Fire Aspect or I'm breaking anything like that, but I do have Sharpness 4 and Sweeping Edge 3, which Sweeping Edge won't really help me that much, but Sharpness 4 should help me do a little bit of extra damage. So, alright, come on, Ender Dragon. Actually, I'm not going to shoot unless I know I can for sure make the shot. I just have to wait for her to come down. Hopefully she comes near pretty quickly here. I don't want to drag on this fight any longer than it has to take. Oh, is she coming down? I think she's coming down. Okay, we got it once. Twice. And third time's the charm. Or fourth. Uh, maybe fifth. Okay. Here's where you can't attack her anymore. And I think, if I'm correct, you have to like build up and like hit her from behind but then her wings do damage see oh there you go you have to jump that's what it is oh and it will do water okay we're done. <laughs> let's get out of the dragon breath oh i should have brought glass bottles with me i'm dumb oh actually doing a decent amount of damage when i crit here yeah but i should have brought bottles for the dragon's breath i didn't think about that Oh, and there we go. All right, water. Water. All right, we're good. <laughs> All right, well, I mean, hey, the Ender Dragon's already all, more than half done. We still have a few arrows. Just have to wait for her to come down probably one or two more times. In the meantime, we can kill some Endermen for some Ender Pearls because I want to take some home. They're nice to have. I also think we will make an Enderman farm soon because I actually, I've never made an Enderman farm tutorial on my channel at all, so maybe it's time to make one. I love my pro aim skills. <laughs> but yeah, it's probably time for a tutorial. I think it'll be fun. Just gotta be careful here. Wait for the dragon to come down one more time. See, all these endermen look angry at the dragon too. I'm not the only one that doesn't like this dragon. Oh, that was a bad shot. <laughs> How many arrows do I have left? Uh, five. All right. Let's make these shots count. Come on, dragon. I'm waiting for you. Oh dang, I tried. <laughs> come on, dragon. Please, just come down. This is taking too long. <laughs> Maybe she's just going to spiral until I hit her or something. Or I could always use the technique where I bring beds. I've seen people do that to kill the dragon. It looks interesting, actually. But... Aw, oh, dang. <laughs> I tried. Come on. Oh, wait. Is she coming down now? I think she is. One. Two. Three. Oh, we're out of arrows. All right. Time for the swords. This might be finishing off the dragon right here. Oh, maybe not. Okay. Well, let's head over. This crit gets on her. Oh, my gosh. I forgot I have to get behind her wings. Or else she's just going to do too much damage to me. Oh, my gosh. I can't even hit her. <laughs> You're a feisty dragon. Okay. 
See, my thorns are hurting her. Come on. Take you down. Oh, no. She's so close. We can do it. Come on. Come on. No. Oh, okay, let's eat a golden apple. No, she got away. Oh, literally like one or two more hits and she's done for. Wait. Maybe I can collect some of these arrows around here. Oh, I despawned right before I was going to collect it. All right, let's see if there's any more. I was shooting in this direction, trying to get the towers. There might be some arrows on the ground around here that I can pick up and use to finish off the dragon. Because I know I missed a few of my shots. I got most of them. I'm a fairly decent sniper, but we got to get this dragon. <laughs> most of the arrows have probably despawned by now, actually, so... Maybe it's best to just wait for her. I don't really know. Hmm. Let's see. Any arrows? I don't see any. I should have crafted some more before I came here. Come on, dragon. Calm down. <laughs> Honestly, I could probably punch her a few times with my fist and she'd be dead, so... I'm hoping she comes down pretty soon. Oh, is she coming down now? Okay, there we go. One or two more hits, and it should be the end of this. I'm just going to lay back here. Watch my XP go from 20 to 80 real quick. <laughs> Alright, come on. And boom, there we go. Free the end. Got to get those screenshots. Possible thumbnail. <laughs> Oh, that's right. Let it rain XP. This is the best part. <laughs> Just getting all the XP. So much fun. Let's see what level we get up to. Oh, yeah. <laughs> all right, from 27 to 66. That's not bad. Uh, where's the portal? Right over there. Okay. And then here's the egg, which we can actually... Oh, okay. Let's take care of you guys first. Hold up. <laughs> There's a lot of Endermen after me now. Oh, gosh. Watch me die right now. Trying to get them lumped up to take advantage of the sweeping edge. All right, so what I can do actually is I can hopefully break the torch, collect it, and then use the torch to get the egg. So where'd the egg go? All you have to do is place the torch under the egg and you can get it. Um, so let's do that really fast. I just have to be careful. Place it on my offhand. So break, place. Okay, too slow. What? Okay, let me. Maybe they patched this. Last time I checked, this worked. So, hmm. Oh, okay. You just have to be quicker. And there we go. We got the next generation achievement. We're doing pretty decent on our way to getting all the achievements. I mean, there's still a lot we have to get. Let's see how we're doing, though. I mean, yeah, we have a decent amount. I have to get the elytra, all that stuff. But yeah, there we go. We officially beat Minecraft. Anyways, guys, that's all for this series. Um, I'll be done with this survival series since we find... No, I'm kidding. <laughs> but there we go. Uh, oh, oh. <laughs> I was like, wait, why aren't we in our house? I forgot we slept in that villager's bed. But yeah, there we go. We defeated the dragon. Pretty successful fight. Um, I guess as for the dragon egg, let's just place it in our house for now since I don't really need it. I'll probably build some monument or... Something fancy for another time. But yeah, there we go. We beat the dragon. Lots more fun things to come soon. Uh, I also want to do the wither fight soon. Like I said, get the elytra, maybe make an enderman farm. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like and subscribe. Again, like I said, I apologize if I'm a little off. <laughs> Just a little out of it. Zoning out quickly. You know, I've been tired. It's been rough. But so thankfully, that'll be done soon. Anyways, this is Jay Wisp. Thank you all. So, so much for watching. I truly do appreciate all the support on the series. But this is Jay Wisp, and I will see you all in the next one.